Hi guys, we're at Sim Racing Expo 2023 here and I'm at the Acid Tech booth with the man behind the tech and he's going to share with us what they brought to the table here and what's new from Acid Tech. Yeah, so this year we have a, we're introducing this new button box. We have both the Forte and the La Prima button box which is our entry and our mid-tier product level. And uh, what we've done is we have made this uh, button box where there is no rim attached but you can attach six different rims to it. We have two open D-shapes like this. We have two D-shapes and two round wheels. So essentially with this button box, you can have six different wheels. So you can do everything from rally to GT, drift, touring car, whatever, with one wheel essentially. I think what a lot of people would like to know, there's quite a few uh, people doing the budget thing. Yeah. And what they will probably want to do is just buy one button box to start with. Exactly. And then maybe a few wheel rims. Exactly. Is it easy though to swap the button box and the wheel rims or is it to it's take very one? Easy. It's just six screws here behind the wheel. Just unbolt, take it off, put on the new rim, six screws, you're ready to go. Okay, so it's not it's not like a total immediate quick change, but you could it's change not it. Like over. A, it's not like it's not like the the quick release, you know. Okay. But it's but essential, but because you, you wanted to re rig it, you know, and we had to do it like how it's possible to yeah. do it, like in a rigid manner. So yeah, that's awesome. And so, um, how much will you be doing the the button box for? So uh, the La Prima is the lowest tier we have. That is two seventy nine ninety nine. And for the Forte, it's three seventy nine ninety nine, and then with a a wheel, it will be three ninety nine or four ninety nine USD in total okay. for a wheel, and then it's a hundred and twenty additional for each rim that you want to put or yeah. add to it. And will you be doing a uh, like a package or an offer, but where you could buy the wheel and the button box together, a discount so rate or something? We are launching the the wheel on the twenty of November. So that's when we will release the different packages and what, what we are, yeah. So thanks for taking the time to talk to me about the uh, new uh, wheel rims and button box that you're bringing. I'm now gonna jump onto one of the simulators and we're gonna give it a little test and see what it feels like to use. So uh, yeah, cheers, nice to talk there. Okay, so let's do some driving with this wheel rim. And uh, one of the things that you really notice with these wheel rims is, as I say, the actual, the quality of them is really really nice like this one here that we've got with the uh, la prima uh, base uh, the outside rim has this sort of leather stitching on it and this nice uh, two-tone from the uh, from the sides to the top and the nice molding and again i think it's quite nice that they've done this whole solution with a button box and then you've been able to choose your wheel rims because you know obviously people have different uh, taste when it comes to what wheel rim they want to use and then the button boxes are kind of uniform. Uh, so the difference between the different button boxes is though that uh, the La Prima one has slightly less buttons on it, slightly less LED lights and the uh, the Forte here has uh, more lights, more options on it and uh, Acer Tech actually also have a specific software that they developed for this new button box which uh, allows you to configure all the LED lights, to use the lights as a spotter, and a whole bunch of other options uh, that you can just set up as a user, which is really cool. I think Acer Tech have gone from just delivering their DD wheel bases and the basic formula rim they had to now expanding it so that if you're getting into the Acer Tech ecosystem, you have a lot more options there. Um, and as I say, the main thing and the crucial thing for me and I think for most sim racers is that Acer Tech are keeping the pricing down. Uh, personally, when it comes to the DD wheels, I would say, having used most of the wheels on the market, the big decider isn't necessarily the uh, DD wheel base, but it's the wheel rims and the price of the wheel rims and the quality to price ratio of those wheel rims. Um, and with this, uh, Acer Tech are really really moving things uh, in, into a price positive realm for many sim racers. Uh, talking a bit about the uh, the wheelbases here, this is the Invitica wheelbase, which is, uh, I think it goes up to 27 Newton meters. It's like the full full power jobby on this. Um, and there are other wheelbases as well. I think their lowest one is around about 12 Newton meters. It might be a bit lower than that. I can't remember the exact numbers, but the, uh, the Acer Tech wheelbases, driving it right now and having driven them before, some of the uh, you know top-notch force feedback 
I would say it's uh, up there with the sort of Simia cubes in terms of that uh, quality of force back feel. Really, really smooth, really detailed. Uh, you can tell that it's got a great slew rate. <laughs> slew rate is the, uh, the uh, term that everyone should be focusing on when it comes to direct drive wheels. Uh, how fast the wheel can basically accelerate in the different directions and then also the sort of sustained loading. Um, this just feels like really good quality equipment. So uh, we're definitely getting to a point now where it's really, really getting hard for people to choose between the sort of Moses, the Fanatex, the Logitech, the Thrustmasters and the and the uh, Assetek wheels. Uh, sim racing is... Uh, getting getting uh, full of, of hardware. But uh, yeah, I, I just have to say, I have genuinely been really uh, sort of blown away, not just with Acer Tech, but with other equipment in Sim Race and Expo, at the quality of the offerings, and uh, really nice to see this, uh, this sort of stuff from more companies. In the future, on the channel, guys, we will do a proper investigation to this equipment, proper testing. As I've been saying in these videos, Simrex and Expo is a trade show where you can only really just jump on and quickly feel things out and have a little go, but you, you really need to try it with your own settings to really know how good stuff is and how good it is over a long period of time. But uh, I'd say watch out other companies. Acer Tech's here and they were serious with the DDs last year. Now they're serious with, the, with their wheel rims and their wheel rim pricing. But uh, that's your introduction to the new wheel rims and button boxes from Acer Tech at Simrex and Expo. Thank you very much for watching this. Make yourselves a cup of tea, drown yourselves in tea, click that like button, click the subscribe button. Also, check out the cameraman. Check out the cameraman. Just rotate the camera manually. <laughs> There's the cameraman. Thank you very much for Simpit Amir for, for filming us there. Till the next one, guys. Take care and goodbye.